What's up guys? Welcome back to Nothing To Do Crew. I'm Nick DeVos coming at you with another awesome DIY project. Let's check it out. Seriously? So today we're gonna to be building these awesome knife throwing targets here. And they're awesome because one, they're portable so you can uh, take them apart and put them in your car. And second, the arms are adjustable, so you can just put it into whichever position you want. Now I suppose you could probably use a hatchet or an axe because they are really sturdy, but mine are really dull so I don't think they'll work. But let's try it out. But anyways, I built these for throwing knives and I bought a few different sets on Amazon. Uh, some were better than others and I found the ones that actually work the best are these Hibben throwing knives I'll put a link to those in the description below But enough talking now. It's time to show you how to build one or two If you want to build one of these guys I put together this free ebook uh, Basically has step-by-step -step instructions that walk you through the entire process and I'll put a link to that in the description below so your first step is you want to cut all your lumber, all your 4x4s and 2x4s. And to help make this a little bit easier, I created this cheat sheet. And the next step is to cut your threaded rod. Uh, there's four pieces. There's one here, one here, and two down at the feet. Up next, you want to assemble your base. And using three inch screws, you can secure this piece in. And then you can secure down here. Next up, you're going to want to drill the hole for the legs, and to do this, we'll be using a 9 16th bit. Uh, we'll use this bit to drill all the holes in the entire project. And so when you drill the hole for this leg, it should be one and three quarters up and centered, and you're going to want to drill all the way through. There we go. So once you have the hole drilled for both legs, you can put it flush up against the outside, run a marker all the way through the hole, and mark it on this board. And then drill that hole and then come from this side put the marker through mark that hole and once you have your holes drilled for these things then you can secure it all together and up next it's time to attach the ears and to do that i just put a three inch screw towards the bottom and one towards the top Make sure it's nice and flush with his head here. And then it's on to the most difficult part of this entire build is drilling the holes for the two threaded rods all the way through your guy. And so we'll start with the shoulder holes. And to do this, you wanna measure three and a half inches from the top down. Make sure it's nice and centered in the middle of the board and drill a hole through it. And then once you finish with this one, move on to the next one, next one, next one, next one, next one, all the way through to this arm. And now for the bottom one, you're not gonna drill through the arms. So you're gonna start one board in, measure five inches up from the bottom, drill a hole through, and again, go board to board to board all the way to this one. And then once you have your holes drilled, then it's time to insert the threaded rods. And it definitely helps to have a hammer close by. And to help show you where the hardware goes, I made this diagram. Thanks for watching the video. If you liked it, make sure you hit that subscribe button because I'm not very great at making videos on a consistent basis. But if you're subscribed, anytime I make one, you'll get notified. And we'll see you guys next time.